Hello, beautiful souls. Again, this may not be for everyone, but if you've noticed this dynamic with a particular person, it's because it's part of your soul contract with each other to actually push you both back within yourselves, to connect with your highest vibrational version of yourselves, rather than focusing or fixating on the external world, even when that external world is you focusing on the connection or the other person. This very much has a twin flame energy, the energy of a spiritually catalyzing connection that has activated you both to reach your highest soul potential, which involves a lot of self-focus, focusing on your own path, your own soul's growth and evolution. So you might find this ironic dynamic where the more you focus on them and on trying to make the connection work, the more it feels like the two of you are separating or experiencing division or just a disconnect. But the more you focus within yourself, the more you create this magnetic polarity that draws the two of you together more strongly. Again, I don't really know who I am speaking to here, but I hope that message reached you. I do channel many different people, situations, and connections throughout these reading videos, so please, as always, only take what connects with you personally. Now I do want to channel a bit more into this lover's energy. What else can I channel for this lover's card? Four of Swords reversed. Someone could have escaped or walked away from some kind of situation. They may be going through a major transition in their life, but feeling as though they're spinning or having trouble moving forward. Almost like a never-ending transition. Like trying to get somewhere, but always feeling like you're in flux. I know that it's kind of difficult to find the words to describe this energy. It may be difficult even for the person I'm connecting into here to really describe why they're feeling the way that they're feeling or what is going on here, because this situation does have a lot of energy of confusion around it. With Ace of Swords reversed, someone may feel as though they failed at something here. I'm getting a lot of masculine energy from this card, so this could be a masculine that you, Divine Feminine, are connected to, who is in a very low space mentally at this time sitting in a lot of heavy regret, feeling as though they failed towards you in some way. And I have a card coming out here, King of Wands. Interestingly, it came out in the middle position, which tells me that this masculine may be transitioning from the King of Wands reversed energy, which is someone who is sometimes focused on themselves at the expense of others, someone who could be possibly lying about something. I get, in the past, there may have been this energy of this masculine either lying to you, divine feminine, or lying to themselves about how they were really feeling towards you, not really keeping their heart open. In fact, closing their heart really hard to you, into this connection that led to that king of wands reversed energy. From divine muscular. Tight, yes, if you believe. 